2023 was truly the luckiest year ever for lottery players. The three biggest jackpots in history were claimed, yes, you guessed it, in 2023. But not just that, winners of the fifth and eighth largest prizes in the history of the lottery also won in 2023. The numbers alone will make your head spin, but their stories are even crazier. So don't miss out. Get ready to meet the eight lucky people who hit the jackpot of a lifetime. Number 8. The Anonymous Texan $361 million on November 15th, Texas witnessed a lottery event like no other. A staggering $361 million Mega Millions jackpot was won by a single person, which is the largest ever jackpot to be won in the state. This record-breaking prize came after a suspenseful 15 draws with no winner. And when someone finally won, we got to know that the lucky ticket was sold at a Stripes convenience store in San Angelo. And why is that important here? Well, because even the store received a $1 million reward for selling the winning ticket. Now, you might be thinking the winner would be ready for their moment in the spotlight, but nope, not this Texan. Even though Texas law allows lottery winners to keep their identity anonymous, this winner took anonymity to the next level. Instead of claiming the prize personally, they went through South Dakota's Blue Yucca Trust. This mysterious trust from Rapid City opted for a lump sum and received a pre-tax windfall of $157,367,045. That's a record breaker right there, setting a new high for Texas lottery payouts. So while the identity of this Texan remains a mystery, one thing is for sure. They have made lottery history just like these next two lucky winners, or maybe one. Number 7. Two Lucky Tickets $394 million In the world of lotteries, it's not every day that you hear about two winning tickets for the same jackpot, winning in the same state. But that's exactly what went down with a 394 mil Mega Millions jackpot last month. In fact, you'll be shocked to hear that the two winning tickets did not just win from the same state, but were bought from the same store. The lucky spot was a Chevron gas station on Ventura Boulevard in Encino, California. Both tickets were bought there and matched all six numbers, even the gold Mega Ball. This happened last December 8th, and no wonder everyone is eager to learn the mystery behind it. How did two jackpot winning tickets even end up in the same store? Was it one lucky person buying the same combinations, or maybe friends who decided to go in on the same numbers? Well, the mystery continues because the winners haven't stepped up yet, and the California lottery is not ready to reveal any details to the public. As unusual as it is for two tickets from the same location to win, it is pretty common for winners to take their sweet time coming forward. In California, winners often take a few weeks or even months to be verified. Whoever these lucky folks are, they're about to split the fourth largest Mega Millions jackpot of the year. A South Dakota-based trust had won in Texas last October, so the jackpot had been growing since then. It had reached a jaw-dropping $394 million, which means the winners are going to get 188.6 mil each in cash value. As unusual as it was, it wasn't the first time something like this happened in California. A couple of years back in December 2020, two players won a jackpot at a 7-Eleven in Vallejo, and they even shared the same last name. What are the odds, right? So as we wait for the big reveal in Encino, it's fun to think about the odds of buying a winning ticket, let alone two at the same place. This Chevron station has become a sort of lucky landmark now. While we don't know the name of these two lucky winners, we do know the name of the winner who won New York's biggest ever jackpot this year. Number 6. The Golden Years – $483 million This is the story of a 71-year-old New Yorker, Johnny Taylor. Johnny closed the chapter on his working life last year. He was ready to embrace the calm of retirement when, out of the blue, he hit a massive $483 million jackpot in April. Talk about perfect timing! And it wasn't just any win, it was the largest in New York's history and ranks as the 29th largest jackpot ever. And Johnny was the sole king of this cash mountain. So what did he do? Well, he opted for the lump sum option and received 269.9 mil. After the federal government took a portion of the winnings in taxes, Johnny received $157 million. 
Now, imagine the excitement when Johnny told his wife they were millionaires. At first, his wife didn't believe him. He had to literally show her the numbers on their ticket and compare them to the winning digits online. Only then did she believe they had won, and they'd won it big. So what does a 71-year-old new millionaire do? Well, it seemed like Johnny did have some plans. He bought a shiny new house and a hybrid car and started checking off his bucket list of travel destinations. Even though he was rich, he didn't forget his roots. The man made a generous donation to his church. Before Johnny's win, four other New Yorkers won $1 million each. Impressive, sure, but next to Johnny's gigantic win, it was like comparing a puddle to the ocean. While Johnny was lucky to get his big break during his golden years, this next winner was even luckier to get it soon. Very, very soon. Number 5. Boeing's Latest Jumbo Jet $754 million This is the story of Becky Bell, who turned a quirky coincidence into a life-changing win. Last year in February, the Powerball jackpot had climbed to a massive 754 mil. It was the fifth largest prize ever at that time. Even though the ranking later fell to the 12th biggest in history, who's counting when you're talking about this kind of cash, right? So Becky was a worker at Boeing Manufacturers, and she loved to play the lottery. This time, she had already bought a ticket, but when she noticed the jackpot sitting at 747 mil, she remembered something. She remembered that Boeing's last 747 jumbo jet had been released just days before. And did you notice it too? The similarity between the aircraft name and the lottery price? So Becky took it as a sign and she bought a second ticket. And guess what? It was this second ticket that she bought while shopping with her daughter at a Fred Meyer grocery store that hit the jackpot. The morning after the draw, Becky woke up early for work at 6.20 a.m. She decided to scan her tickets before leaving for work. The first one was a bummer, but the second one flashed the words every lottery player dreams of. Winning ticket. Claim at the lottery office. In disbelief, Becky double-checked the winning numbers online. They matched perfectly. Overwhelmed with emotion, she cried, woke her children at home, and called her other daughter and family members, making sure she wasn't seeing things. But the win was real, and she really had won a staggering $754 million. Choosing the lump sum option, Becky ended up with a whopping $309 million after taxes. And you might have already guessed what was next for her early retirement from Boeing. But Becky's win didn't just change her life. The Fred Meyer store where she bought the golden ticket also won a $50,000 bonus. And here's where the story gets even better. They decided to donate most of this bonus to a local food bank that provided 66,000 meals to those in need. Only a portion was kept for a well-deserved staff party. It was truly a heartwarming story. When Becky won the lottery, the whole town got to know about her massive win. She didn't hesitate to share the news with everyone. But it was so unlike our next winner who tried as hard as they could to keep their identity anonymous. Number 4. The Clever Winner $1.6 billion In August, the Mega Millions jackpot hit a record-breaking high, and a Floridian walked away with it. It was a massive $1.62 billion. The lucky ticket was bought at a Publix grocery store, and boy did it stir up some excitement. Now, Florida has some unique lottery laws. Unlike other states, Florida lets winners stay anonymous, but on one condition. You can keep your identity anonymous for just 90 days. After that, you have to go public and reveal your name. This rule gives winners a golden window to sort their lives out before the media frenzy and money requests start pouring in. Our winner claimed the prize on September 25th, so let's do the quick math. They had until late December to enjoy their anonymity. Their payout was a whopping 794 mil before the taxes. After the federal government took their share of the winnings, the winner received a sweet $595 million. And guess what? Since there are no state taxes in Florida on lottery winnings, they got to keep the remaining amount. Score? So we all knew about the 90-day deal. So everyone was ticking off days on their calendars waiting for this mystery millionaire to step into the limelight. But not so quick. The winner had a clever trick up their sleeve. The winner decided to go the extra mile for privacy and set up an out-of-state LLC. Now, that's some 007-level stealth. So what do we know about this undercover millionaire? 
nada. They're keeping it tighter than a top secret mission. It's been over 90 days and they're still incognito. How are they spending their fortune? Your guess is as good as mine. Maybe they're buying islands, maybe they're chilling on a yacht, or maybe they're just Netflixing in their PJs. Who knows? In this story, we don't know the winner's name because they don't want us to know. But in our next story, maybe even the winner doesn't know that they've won the jackpot of their life. Number 3. The Winner Who Went M.I.A. $1.08 billion This is the story of the Powerball jackpot that got everyone excited in July last year. Now, this wasn't just any jackpot. For three whole months, it was like nobody wanted to win it. By July 19th, it had ballooned into the third largest in Powerball's history, which now ranks as the eighth biggest ever. And then suddenly, there was a winner. It was revealed that the lucky ticket was sold at Los Pitas Mini Market in California. But let me tell you the most surprising part. The winner has become like a ghost. Totally M.I.A. After the winning numbers were displayed, a video went viral. It was from the mini market where the ticket was sold. In it, there was this woman right at the counter, and let me tell you, she was going through all the emotions. She was seen hugging people, squealing, and even crying and dashing out of the store. The internet went nuts. Everyone thought, that's it, we found our billionaire. But plot twist, she wasn't the winner. The store owner cleared that no one had checked the billion dollar winning ticket there. The employees were just as confused. They knew she didn't have the golden ticket. So why the Oscar-worthy performance? Some said she won in her five minutes of fame. Others, who knows. But one thing is for sure, she wasn't our billionaire. Now back to the real winner. It's like they've vanished into thin air. They've got six months to come forward and claim the prize. If they don't, they miss out on this life-changing pile of cash. But here's a thought. What if, just what if, the woman in that video is the real winner? It seems far-fetched now, but in the world of billion-dollar jackpots, who knows? Most big winners like to keep it low-key, but maybe, just maybe, she is the one. While we don't know who the winner is yet, we do know who became the first billionaire from the lottery in 2023. Number 2. The First Billionaire of 2023 $1.35 billion 2023 started with a bang in the lottery world, especially for one lady from Lebanon, Maine. She hit the lottery jackpot big time by winning $1.35 bill. At that point, her win was the fourth largest in lottery history. But with 2023's jackpot frenzy, it's now at number six. This lady, who kept her identity anonymous, was the only one who hit the jackpot. No sharing, no splitting, all that cash was hers and hers alone. But before you get too excited, remember the federal government always gets a piece of the pie. She went for the lump sum option, so she got a whopping $723 million. Then the taxes cut 173.6 mil from her winnings. And Maine, not wanting to be left out, took another 51 million. So our winner didn't quite hit billionaire status, but still walked away with a staggering $498 million. That's still not bad, right? But who is this mystery woman? Well, she's still keeping it on the down low. She claimed her fortune through a company named Loma Island Investments so that she could keep her identity anonymous. This is how she escaped the eyes of the media and also her friends and relatives who might have wanted a piece of the wealth. And let's not forget, being rich comes with its own set of rules. Privacy is key when you're sitting on a mountain of cash, and it looks like our winner is playing it safe from the get-go. But this is not the end of this story. You see, the golden ticket was sold at Hometown Gas & Grill, and guess what? The store hit a mini jackpot too and won a $50,000 bonus. The owner, Fred, decided to share his winnings, so he split it with his employees. So while our main millionaire might have already figured out what to do with her almost half a bill, she's not the only one celebrating. Last year was a game changer for many. After this billion dollar jackpot in January came another in October, and it was kind of a big deal. Number 1. The Second Biggest Winner 1.76 billion dollars. This is about the 1.76 billion dollar Powerball jackpot from October 12th. It was the one that had been climbing for weeks. The entire lottery world was on pins and needles waiting for someone, anyone, to hit those winning numbers. It felt like this gigantic pot of money was just getting bigger and bigger, taunting us all. But then, bam! 
someone out there beat the 1 in 292.2 million odds. And guess what? The golden ticket was sold north of Los Angeles. If that's where you got your Powerball ticket, you might want to sit down for this. The magic numbers were 22, 24, 40, 52, 64, and the Powerball 10. If you're staring at those numbers on your ticket right now, congratulations! You're officially the envy of… well, everyone. This lucky duck is the only one who nailed the jackpot, meaning they don't have to split that mind-boggling $1.76 billion with anyone. Decisions, decisions though. They can either take the whole sum in 30 installments over 29 years, or just say give me the cash and walk away with a lump sum of $756.6 million. Either way, that's a whole lot of zeros. But hey, it wasn't just the big winner who struck a gold. There were winners from Arizona to Pennsylvania who picked five right numbers. Some even had the power play option, doubling their win to two mil. And then a whopping seven players matched five numbers without the power play, and each won a million bucks. These lucky people were from scattered areas across states like New York, California, Oklahoma, Florida, and Virginia. Now let's get back to the juicy part. Our mysterious $1.76 billion winner hasn't come forward yet. Yup, it's been three months, and we're all just here twiddling our thumbs waiting. They have nine months left to claim their prize, so maybe they're getting their ducks in a row, finding financial advisors, or just trying to breathe. Who knows? Whoever they are, they're out there, probably planning how to handle all that dough. So while we wait for the big reveal, let's just imagine what we would do with that kind of cash. Dream big, right? So guys, these were the eight crazy stories of the biggest lotto winners of 2023. Now, do you want to hear about the smartest winners of last year? The ones who showed us that the lottery might be just a game of luck, but you actually have to be smart to keep those winnings forever. You'll be surprised at what they did.